My name is Lawrence Allen. I'm living in Fairlane Subdivision in Alexander City, Alabama. I was in the Navy during World War II and served in the South Pacific. I was a signalman. Boy, the signalman just sent silent signals. You use semaphore and, uh, and bright lights. The Mars code used bright lights. I was on two ships, one during the war and one after the war. I was on USS uh, SS George Davidson during the war. It was a merchant marine ship and had naval personnel aboard merchant marine ships during the war. When the war was over, I had, they took all the naval people off the merchant marine ships and put me on USS Castor. So we went back to the South Pacific. Second trip around, it wasn't shooting bullets at us, so I didn't like it. I didn't like somebody telling me what to do. I was too bullheaded. I was living in Ellick City. I know I wasn't born and raised here. I was transferred here, but I was had an appointment with Dr. Lloyd Moore. I hadn't listened to the news that morning, and when I got to the, his office, J.B. Shockley was there. J.B. Shockley was also very much involved in World War II. He was in the European theater, and he and I, he asked me had I heard the news that the twin towers had been attacked, and I told him no. So he got to tell me about it, and we both. I remember commenting to here goes World War III, and we, we continued to talk about it, and we remembered that World War II was won by the trained military people, the generals and the admirals. Every, every war since then has been lost by the politicians in Washington. So we discussed as a wonder who's going to fight this war, the politicians or the trained military people. And it, it was lost by the politicians, in my opinion. A, a, a lot of American military people killed and accomplished a th didn't accomplish a thing in the world, to my knowledge. In, in, in World War II, we won the war, for both over Germany and over Japan. Uh, Japan. And we didn't win it. Our military trained leaders uh, uh, did. Our trained military leaders did. The politicians pretty well stayed out of it.